I'm probably spending way too much mental energy on this, but I went back and listened to all your old music and you were way better when you were writing riffs and singing like a normal person. Drop the cartoon voice, start writing riffs, and your stuff will come across so much better. Listen, I appreciate you going and listening to the music because at least you're putting a little bit of effort into this, but there's something that you need to understand about that early music. See, I had just come off of playing in a horror punk band for like a decade that didn't pan out and it was very big, it was very theatrical and I was pretty bummed out that it didn't work in any way. Like we had gotten some interest from labels and stuff but it all, whatever, it shit the bed. So then I spent a bunch of time writing music that I thought other people would like. Like trying to be a musician that I thought like punk rock dudes would like. You know, writing riffs and kind of, you know, sort of like half yell singing, really just like not writing music I wanted to write, but writing music for other people. That ended up spanning like a almost a decade of me trying out a bunch of different things and different songwriting styles, just like trying to become a better songwriter. But the entire time I was like putting on characters, right? Oh, the punk rock guy. Oh, the poppy guy. Oh, the super indie guy. Like all of that was disingenuous. It's so the irony that you're like, oh, I liked your music more when you were pretending to be something more like something I like is just... <laughs> <laughs> Look, anybody that knows me knows that I have like a big, annoying, theatrical voice. I am really high energy most of the time. I'm very chaotic. So what you think is like a cartoon voice is me actually just using my real voice. I used to have to spend take after take after take to get my voice to sound right. Kind of like that thing that you're looking for, that like brand new clone thing. Like I barely do multiple takes when I'm recording anymore. The voice that you're hearing, that's just the way my voice comes out. And you're saying that you like it better when I am protect when I sound more like somebody else. I could be a really good clone of someone else. If I just acted more like somebody else, it would be better. The stuff that I've put out over the past year, that's like me just doing the stuff that I really enjoy. That's like my voice is big and annoying and theatrical and full of these weird noises and scratchy voices and stuff. That's, that's who the fuck I am. And if it's not for you, that's fine. I don't really care because <laughs> I'm going to keep making this music because it's what makes me happy. And let's be real. You want to talk about riffs? Have you actually listened to the, like the, all the songs I've been putting out? Bro, there are riffs in there. Way better riffs than I was writing before. Way better riffs. Boy oh boy, if you could hear the songs in my unreleased folder right now, whew, you'd have to change your underpants. It's real good, that's all I'm saying.